In the 1960s, a computer scientist named Douglas Engelbart was working at the Stanford Research Institute in California. Engelbart was a visionary who believed that computers could be used to enhance human intelligence and creativity. He was particularly interested in developing ways for people to interact with computers more easily and intuitively. One day, Engelbart was watching a demonstration of an early computer system that used a light pen as an input device. He realized that the light pen was not very practical for everyday use, and he started to think about other ways to control a computer. Inspired by a device used by the U.S. Air Force to control radar systems, Engelbart came up with the idea for a mouse. He enlisted the help of his colleague Bill English. The first mouse was a wooden block with two wheels and a small button on top. When the user moved the mouse across a surface, the wheels turned and transmitted the movement to the computer. The button was used to select objects on the screen, and in 1968, they demonstrated their invention at a historic event known as the mother of all demos. The demo was a live presentation of the latest computer technology, and it showcased a range of cutting-edge innovations, including the mouse. The mouse quickly became a popular input device for computers, and it revolutionized the way people interact with technology. 